Origins Space Telescope is a concept study for the Far Infrared Surveyor Space Telescope mission. Still a preliminary concept in formulation, it will be presented to the United States Decadal Survey in 2019 for a possible selection to NASA's flagship program. The OST would provide an array of new tools for studying star formation and the energetics and physical state of the interstellar medium within the Milky Way using infrared radiation and new spectroscopic capabilities. Study groups, primarily composed of international community members, will prioritize the science identification and science drivers of the mission architecture. The study groups draw upon input from the international astronomical community, such a large mission will need international participation and support to make it a reality. Topic. Overview In 2016, NASA began considering four different space telescopes for the flagship program mission, they are the Habitable Exoplanet Imaging Mission HABIX, Large UV Optical Infrared Surveyor LUVOIR, Origins Space Telescope OST, and Lynx X-ray Surveyor. In 2019 the four teams will turn their final reports over to the National Academy of Sciences, whose independent decadal survey committee advises NASA on which mission should take top priority. If funded, it would launch approximately in 2035. Topic. An evolving concept The roadmap envisaged a space observatory with a large gain in sensitivity over the Herschel Space Observatory, better angular resolution with at least a four-order of magnitude sensitivity improvement over Herschel. NASA is leading several teams to develop a scientifically compelling mission concept for presentation to the Decadal Survey in 2019. The mission development relies on the identification of primary science drivers to establish the technical requirements for the observatory. The workgroups have identified these baseline architecture topics Cosmic dawn and reionization Evolution of galaxies and black holes Volume of local galaxies and the Milky Way Interstellar medium Protoplanetary disks, planet formation, exoplanets, star formation, and evolved stars The solar system topic. Water transport Early and preliminary goals for the Origin Space Telescope mission include the study of water transport as both ice and gas from the interstellar medium to the inner regions of planet-forming disks, from interstellar clouds, to protoplanetary disks, to Earth itself—in order to understand the abundance and availability of water for habitable planets. In the Solar System, it will chart the role of comets in delivering water to the early Earth by tracing their molecular heredity of deuterium-hydrogen ratio. Topic. Preliminary characteristics The Origin Space Telescope would perform astrometry and astrophysics in the mid to far infrared range by using a filled aperture telescope with an effective diameter likely between 8 m and 15 m. The telescope will require cryocooler systems to actively cool detectors at 50 mK and the telescope optics at 4 k. It will attain sensitivities 100, 1,000 times greater than any previous far infrared telescope, targeting exoplanet observations in the 6 to 40 micrometers wavelength range. It will measure the temperatures and search for basic chemical ingredients for life in the atmospheres of small, warm planets at habitable temperatures 300 k, 27 degrees Celsius, and measure their atmospheric composition. This may be accomplished by a combination of transit spectroscopy and direct coronagraphic imaging. Important atmospheric diagnostics include spectral bands of ammonia NH4, a unique tracer of nitrogen, the 9 micrometers ozone line ozone, O3 as a key biosignature, the 15 micrometers CO2 band carbon dioxide as an important greenhouse gas, and many water wavelength bands. Its spectrographs will enable 3D surveys of the sky that will discover and characterize the most distant galaxies, Milky Way, exoplanets, and the outer reaches of the solar system. Topic. Preliminary payload Based on the preliminary goals, five instruments are required. A far-infrared imaging polarimeter. A mid-infrared instrument with imaging. Low-resolution spectroscopy and coronagraphy. A wide-field low-resolution spectrometer. 
a high-resolution far-infrared photon detection spectrometer and a high-resolution heterodyne spectrometer. References <laughs>